Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Does DNA leave the nucleus during mitosis? At the beginning of mitosis, the chromosomes condense, the nucleolus disappears, and the nuclear envelope breaks down, resulting in the release of most of the contents of the nucleus into the cytoplasm. What molecule can leave the nucleus? Messenger RNA mRNA, is a single-stranded RNA molecule that is complementary to one of the DNA strands of a gene. The mRNA is an RNA version of the gene that leaves the cell nucleus and moves to the cytoplasm where proteins are made. Is DNA too large to leave the nucleus? This is how the nucleus is the control center of the cell. The only problem is that the DNA is too big to go through the nuclear pores so a chemical is used to read the DNA in the nucleus. That chemical is messenger RNA, mRNA. The messenger RNA, mRNA, is small enough to go through the nuclear pores. Does DNA leave the nucleus during gene expression? The DNA molecules never leave the nucleus but instead use an intermediary molecule to communicate with the rest of the cell. This intermediary is the messenger RNA, mRNA. Other types of RNA, like rRNA, tRNA, and microRNA, are involved in protein synthesis and its regulation. Why is DNA locked in the nucleus? Inside the nucleus lies the blueprint that dictates everything a cell will do and all of the products it will make. This information is stored within DNA. The nucleus sends commands to the cell via molecular messengers that translate the information from DNA. Why is it so important that DNA stays inside the nucleus? The most important function of the nucleus is to store the cell's genetic information in the form of DNA. DNA holds the instructions for how the cell should work. DNA stands for deoxyribonucleic acid. Does DNA move out of nucleus? Eukaryotic DNA never leaves the nucleus. Instead, it's transcribed, copied, into RNA molecules which may then travel out of the nucleus. In the cytosol, some RNAs associate with structures called ribosomes, where they direct synthesis of proteins. How is the nucleus involved in protein synthesis? The nucleus and its structures eukaryotic cells have a true nucleus, which means the cell's DNA is surrounded by a membrane. Therefore, the nucleus houses the cell's DNA and directs the synthesis of proteins and ribosomes, the cellular organelles responsible for protein synthesis. Why must the nucleus break down during mitosis? The nuclear envelope does not disappear in metaphase of mitosis, because it already did in prophase. The nuclear envelope needs to be broken apart so that the chromosomes can be found aligned in the middle of the cell, and then pulled apart. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. 